You know, I'm not sure whose terrible idea this was, but um, your boy has been promoted. Apparently, the police chief thinks we are responsible and ready enough to wield a nearly 4,000 pound Ford Crown Victoria. That's right, baby. We now have a patrol car. We are no longer going to be walking these streets. No longer hoofing it. We're going to be riding around in style and getting it. So this is going to be fun. I don't know who, you know, I, I mean, like last episode, I was letting people go with 0.1 BACs because I wasn't really paying attention. So I don't know why he thinks we're responsible enough for this. We definitely aren't. I'm just a schmuck in a blue uniform with a stupid Wario mustache, but um, we're going to make the most of it. Oh man, we, we are, we are a big boy now. Look at this. Look at this precinct, dude. This is the, the largest thing we've ever been in. Hey, what up girl with the, that ponytail? You looking, you looking kind of nice too. I like a woman in uniform. That's for sure. All right, let's go ahead and get it. Ah, uh, just kidding. It's my first day on the job. I actually don't know how to get out of here. Hey girl, how you doing? You, you come to the, the, the Brighton police department often. Okay, probably should stop masquerading with the, the females and let's let's get out of here. Is this my car over here? Is this it? Look, Ma! Look at me! It's your boy. Hold on, let me let me take a picture for mom. I'm I'm gonna turn around here. I'm gonna turn around. We're gonna get like this. Look, Ma! Old 12-year-old Danny Lopez. Oh, 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 flex it, Danny. Flex it. Those Tinder matches are, are gonna love this. Alright, here we go. Boys in blue. Let's get it. So we've got our WASD, we've got our handbrake, our cruise control. We've got a turn signal left and right. Interesting. We've got our lights, our sirens, our horn. Pretty cool. Okay. And then we've also got our blip to be able to pull people over. Just kidding. That, that was the headlights. I, I used the wrong thing. This is the blip. Oh, so you've got different sounds and stuff. That's that's kind of cool. We've got our headlights, of course. We've got different cameras. Oh, we can be inside of it. That's pretty nasty. And then we've also got a police computer, which is going to bring up our map. But to be honest, we don't have much else. I know there's an update coming out in a couple of weeks where you're going to be able to do background checks and like look into people's histories and stuff like that. But it's not out yet. So I don't think we're going to be using the map much, but I guess we'll see what happens. So here we go. Let's uh, let's just go ahead and pull out of here, baby. I'm, I'm very excited about this. This is pretty incredible. I can't believe they actually trusted us with a, uh, a vehicle of our own. So I'm going to go ahead and put my right right hand blinker on and it's time to roll around town and see what kind of trouble we can get into they might call us about some wanted suspects we also want to oop 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 wanted to make sure he wasn't too far off hold on a second this guy's a little too far off okay i'm gonna pull over to the side here let me just go ahead and hop out of this thing probably could have put our, our lights on hold on let me let me get back in the car we're gonna put our lights on i want to look cool while i'm doing this let me let me oop that's the siren uh, first, first time here. Okay, we're good. Go ahead and throw the lights on. We don't need the sirens right now, but we got the lights here. Make sure people know how cool we are and our, our presence is known. Okay, you are uh, a little bit too far into the street there, sir. Go ahead and issue a ticket here. I'm, I'm really hoping eventually we're going to be able to get away from, from giving out tickets like this. I really, I mean, I, I kind of want to just roll around and look for people that got into accidents, potentially catch people speeding stuff like this natalie miller she's 25 years old with glasses brown hair pink shirt and she is armed let me see where we're gonna be going looks like we're gonna be back in the melting pot here oh so we're gonna be covering the whole entire district because we're in a car now so we're gonna want to go out take a left check this area we could probably pull over and get out on foot might be the most effective rather than riding around or we could go up take a right we might do that. We might do a circle of the block and then we'll park somewhere over in here. So we're going to want a left and then the right, but check the right side. Okay. Well, let me, uh, don't want to turn those on. Want to come in incognito. Don't want to let them know that we're coming. So let me just go ahead and pull out here and let's go see if we can find Miss Mad Natalie Miller. Let's go see what she's up to. We got to be careful about the whole, uh, actually, you know what? We could, we could probably turn our sirens and stuff on and blow through here. Sirens for no reason. Just kidding. All right. It, it it doesn't it really doesn't want us to do that Okay, looking for a girl in a pink shirt. She could be back in some of these alleys and stuff I mean, I, I thought that's what cops did I 100% I've seen cops Throw on their sirens and, and lights just to blow through an intersection. So that's kind of what I was going for. Excuse me, ma'am uh, Let me give you give you a blip right there. Yep Yep, you the jaywalker let me go ahead and get you. All right. I'm going to go ahead and issue you a violation for jaywalking. 
I'm gonna give you a ticket. Also, I'm sorry for calling you a man. Oh, come on. That's so much money. Well, don't, don't jaywalk. He looks really sad, it says. Interesting. So I wonder if over time it's gonna be a little bit more important to be more lenient, but hey, your boy's gonna lock it down. All right, I don't see her here. I'm gonna go ahead and throw my left blinker on. Our pacing, is that to like see how quick the car in front of us is going? That's kind of cool. Turn my right blinker on. I don't know if this is a turn lane, but I'm gonna use it like one. What was that Lil Wayne lyric? Hi, you're above the law. Yeah, I ran into a car. Uh, we got a red light here. Okay, we're, we're, we're gonna have to... Apparently, we gotta calm it down. We, we, we can't just act like we're, we're God here. We're, we're really gonna have to listen to all the street signs and obey everything. What happens if a cop hits your car? Let me go ahead and put our, our thing on. I'm driving too fast. I'm speeding. Okay. We gotta hit that, that cruise control. Okay, looking for a girl in a pink shirt. Looking for a girl in a pink shirt. She's gotta be somewhere in here. Driving too fast again. Okay, that's just that's just really tough. Okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna throw the lights on here and we're we're just gonna we're gonna park it here. Oh, that's her. Let me uh let me give her one of those. That's her right in front of us. Ma'am, are you packing? Excuse me, ma'am. I don't mean to uh, to cause you any alarm, but please, please, your ID, please, keep your hands where I can see them. I'm gonna Here. confirm that this is Natalie Miller. Let me check her ID. It is Natalie Miller. She low key kind of bad. I, I don't I don't I don't know if I want to put the metal cuffs or these cuffs on her that kind of matches her shirt. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and give this back to you, man. She looks nervous. She knows she did something wrong. I wish we could ask what she's up to. I'm going to go ahead and, uh, I mean, is there anything on you that I need to know about? I'm going to, uh, should we, we should probably detain her. We should probably detain her first. I'm going to detain her for, uh, matching a description. She sounds angry. All right. I'm going to, I'm going to handcuff her. Um, hmm. I guess we probably got to search her first, huh? Just going to do a little pat down real quick. Excuse me, ma'am. Trust me, I'm definitely enjoying this more than you are. She's got a handgun and keys. Now, let me see your ID again. This is a little unprofessional because I should have looked at this first. Ooh, she sounds a little bit upset. I, I'm trying to see. She does not have a gun permit. So she's got a gun on her and she doesn't have a gun permit. I should have checked for that first. We'll know that going forward. All right, I'm going to handcuff you for illegal possession of a weapon. Carrying a gun without a permit. You're a terrible cop. Well, I'm sorry, but, uh, just kidding. Actually, before, before we, we, you know, call her in and, and, and do all that, I'm going to go ahead and do a full search since we, we do know there's something on there. Does she have, oh my God, she's got human teeth on her. A switchblade, a handgun and keys. Okay. Yeah. We're definitely going to get the, we're definitely going to get the boys in here. Dan, the man, we need you immediately. We got some really weird stuff happening. Go ahead and, uh, and come take her away. I got my eyes on you, ma'am. I'm kind of almost tempted to, to maybe get our gun out but she's not resisting or running or anything yet so we're just gonna take it easy for now holy cow we just stopped some sort of a murderous human trafficking something she is she is obviously the, the baddest thing we've ever dealt with uh both in looks and in in actions we got dan here the backup has arrived we're gonna go ahead and uh take you into custody oh oh this is diana we got 360 shift points for that beautiful all right let me go ahead and hop back in the cruiser here hey 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 i caught you you thought you were slick you thought we were tied up with the the you know murderous rampage back there what in the world your hair looks like a lion's mane all right i'm gonna go ahead and give you a jaywalking verbal warning if i see you do it again i'm gonna double your ticket though so just just be ready for that she seems happy. Yeah, we want to keep the peace with the people. Obviously, building relationships with this community is going to be important. We want them to see the boys in blue as friends, as, you know, somebody who's keeping them safe, not somebody who's out here just to get them and give them parking tickets and everything else. So, uh, here we here we go. Ah, uh, I see how the, the what's it called works. I'm driving too fast. Okay, that, well... I thought I saw how it worked, but apparently not. So we're going to keep walking around here or, or you know, kind of cruising around. We can look for people that have like broken tail lights. We can look for people with broken windshields. We can look for people that are speeding. We can wait for more call outs. We can take a look at different. Uh, I mean, this 
he used a turn signal. We can take a look at, at parking spots like this guy over here is kind of a little bit off, but I think I'm going to let him go. That red truck on the, the edge there. Just going to make people really nervous by driving behind them for a really long time. I hate it when I get driven behind by cops. Even if I'm doing nothing wrong, it just it makes you feel like you're doing something wrong. Oftentimes, they're probably like running your plates and stuff like that. We got to figure out how to, how to, what's it called? Ooh, I hear another siren off over here. We got to figure out how to use the, the cruise control so we don't end up speeding. I'm doing a lot of like tapping the button here. Dude, this is so cool. I... The fact that we're out here rolling around doing our thing is, is pretty incredible. All right, going to pass back by the, the police department. This is where we were working on our last shift. Kind of cool. Hmm. So, like, can we... Can I pull up on the right over here? Obviously, I'm not going to go blowing through it. Oh, it's green now. Okay. We might be able to do that. All right, beautiful. We got a cab parked over here. I'm going to go ahead and throw our lights on. Let's get out and... Go ahead and call a tow truck. He is not supposed to be there, that's for sure. Should be an easy one for us. I've got a car here that needs towing. Can you send a wrecker to my current location? Get a wrecker in here. Get our turn signal out. We'll peel back out and keep riding, baby. All right. I mean, this... This is pretty simple. I like it so far. Driving too fast. We are losing a lot of points for driving too fast. Oh, yellow light. It was yellow. It was definitely yellow when we rolled through it. Bit of a, a Chicago stop, I guess you could say it. Just kind of, you know, rolling rather than stopping, but we're okay. So, I mean, I don't... Let me go ahead and take a look at our map here once we get to a stop. I don't think we have anything specific we're supposed to be doing. We probably should get back towards the, uh, the historic downtown since technically that's actually where we're supposed to be. I'm going to go ahead and take a left and then a right. We're going to follow the main street through there. I mean, I, I think we're just supposed to cruise and look out for some troublemakers about two thirds the way through our shift. So we've had a good one so far. I mean, stopping whatever teeth girl, uh, that was, that was pretty clutch. We definitely need to figure out how to drive within the speed limits though. So see, like if I, if I hit shift here which is it's just gonna keep us at 25 okay all right I like that we, we can work with that okay now I understand so I don't want to keep holding forward that's why it was increasing our speed I guess I could get us up to like try to get us to like 30 or something like that but we'll we'll be fine let's just keep on rolling through here we got a green light we could probably uh yellow light all right we're gonna go ahead and stop how y'all doing just gonna make y'all uncomfortable take a look at you let me just uh make sure you're not up to to any nefarious activities out here okay dude this i mean th being a cop would be pretty cool you deal with so like the, the social issues and and a lot of the 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 job is really tough mentally you know dealing with you know Domestic violence cases and stuff like that or like I mean they, they see they see some bad stuff got a couple of buddies who are cops, but I feel like sometimes It'd be so rewarding. It'd be so cool. It'd be so exciting You just have so much new interesting stuff to see and do and also the feeling of oh up oh, up oh, up oh. Let me turn our things on Gotcha hit you with one of these Beautiful. The sirens are not for no reason. No, no, ma'am, stop, stop, ma'am, stop, stop. What in the world? Able to find a proper parking spot. Hold on a second. Oh, she pulled over up there. Okay, I thought she was trying to run for- Hey, ma'am, no! Stop resisting! Stop! I'm gonna have to issue a citation here. You just blew right through that red light, ma'am, and then you tried to run away from me. I really don't appreciate that. Stop it! Stop! Stop! Are you freaking kidding me, dude? Just cut that person off, too. All right, I'm going to get him. Oh, I'm really upset. I feel like we we passed the point of no return, too. Car in front was able to find a parking spot. Okay, I'm going to exit, and you better not pull away. What in the world do you want? How am I supposed to pull people over? Stop! It's just not a great day in the job. Just, just not... Just not a not a great day. Okay, well, I, I mean, I, I I kept hitting R, which is the blip and pull over, and they just keep pulling away. I don't know if this is like a, an early access issue. I'm gonna try it again. Car in front was able to find a proper parking spot. Maybe we pull in front of them. Might be what we're supposed to do. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and pull in front of you. I'm gonna give you a ticket for running that red light. Ah, that might have been it. 
Oh, shoot. Come on, man. Have a nice day. He's past the statute of limitations. We're not going to be able to take him out. But hey, we're getting points for it. So whatever. All right. We'll take it. Okay. Just going to keep on going. Pretend like that whole ordeal didn't happen because that was miserable. Can I get this guy for being too far off the curb? I'm going to go ahead and put our lights on right here. I imagine we could just leave it in the middle of the street. We are a cop after all, right? Let me see you here. Yeah, you're a little bit. What's going on, ma'am? How are you doing? Um... Why, why are you chasing me? Oh, she's good. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and give you a ticket for your alignment for being a little bit too far out. This one's close. It's kind of a tough one because it is on a curve, but you got to do better than that. You are kind of impeding traffic a little bit. Just kidding. Man, we were having a great day, but apparently we just can't do anything now. So one thing I have noticed is all the... It looks like the, the cruise controls are in segments of five. So you can go at 10 or 15 or 20 or whatever else. Just kind of... <laughs> oh my god this the, okay we're, we're fine okay Every, literally everything's falling apart my, my mustache is coming off it's itching my nose and making me sneeze we we really we really messed up a little bit there okay we probably want to turn around and or maybe take a left okay we could take a left let me go ahead and turn my sirens off i'm gonna just sneak on over here if you don't mind just go ahead and switch lanes i didn't ignore a red light that person was speeding i'm getting them turn these on the one in the black. The one in the black over here. Yep, it's you. You knew it. Let me go ahead and uh, pull you over. They're looking for a parking spot. I'm going to turn those sirens off. Signal they're looking for a parking spot. Able to find a proper parking spot. So we're going to keep following them. Are you going to pull over, sir? He's not going to pull over, is he? He just straight up ran from us, dude. Am I going to be able to give him a stern talking to? No, I'm not. Okay, well... I mean, it was a rough first shift in the vehicle. I'm not gonna lie. It, it, it you know, we we lost a lot of conduct points. It, it was it was not the prettiest. Looks like our closest precinct is gonna be over here. Oh, I just ran into somebody again. It uh, it started well. We solved the big crime. It was fantastic. And uh, I mean, pulling people over is is gonna take a little bit of work. Let me yield to the oncoming traffic here, dude. There's just so much that this game this game throws at you, man. I mean, I, I love it. It, it makes me want to you know, get really good at it. And turn our signal on, turn in here. There's just like certain processes you have to follow. I feel like we have our, our, you know, arrest, talk to the people, detain them, kind of process down now. And then the, the first time in the police car was maybe not the, the best shift we've ever had. So, all right. Well, hope you guys enjoyed. Um, I don't, I don't think they're going to be too happy with us. Do I have to go back to a certain... Oh, we can just end the shift anywhere. I was going to say, do I have to go back to my original downtown spot? But looks like we're going to be okay. Yeah, that was um, that was not great. We lost a lot of CP, but we also gained some of the most shift points we've ever had. Conduct was, was bad because we ran into a bunch of stuff. But taking out that pedestrian, finding that wanted person was pretty good. We got a lot of XP and we, we leveled up, so... That's pretty exciting. Unlocked Alchemy. We're going to have a brand new neighborhood in the next episode. Hope you guys are excited for that. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm going to see you guys there. Drop a like unless you want me to throw these bad boys on you and put you in the back of the squad car. Oh, yeah. That's kind of weird. Uh, see you guys later.